Learning more tonight about the local high school graduate who was shot and killed inside that Nashville Christian School on Monday, along with five others. As we first told you last night at 10, Cindy Broyles Peak graduated from Captain Shreve in 1979. KSLA News 12's Jasmine Franklin reports. She was just a bright star and we all loved her dearly. One of the victims from the elementary school shooting in Nashville graduated from high school in Shreveport. Cynthia Peake graduated from Captain Shreve High School in 1979. Her life was cut short Monday as she was substitute teaching at the Covenant Presbyterian Church in Tennessee. Peake is one of three adults and three kids killed in the shooting. News of her passing has spread far and wide. And that just tells you that's a testament to how much she meant to all of us. Peek was a native of Leesville, Louisiana. She spent her first two years of high school at Leesville High before her family moved to Shreveport. Peek completed her junior and senior years at Captain Shreve. During high school, she was known as Cindy Broyles before getting married. A classmate and friend of Peek remembers the impact she made. It just was her spirit and the way that she all united us together. Um, even though for being there a short time, she was not with us the four years that we were there, but she certainly made an impact on being there. Peggy Murphy says she spent a lot of time with Peak. The two were both on the school's pep squad, and they were inducted into the National Honor Society together. I can remember walking the halls. I can remember being in pep squad. I remember, again, that smile, her spirit. She spoke to people, but also how quickly she got involved in school. During high school, Peek was involved in the band and the Future Teachers Association. She went on to become a teacher. So I think she was committed to children and she was committed to the love of learning and education. Friends say Peek had a strong belief in faith and that her spirit touched many lives. In Shreveport, Jasmine Franklin, KSLA News 12.